what's up guys it's me Sean here and uh, in this video tutorial I'll be showing you guys how to use uh, one var stat on your calculator to find a bunch of data or a bunch of information so what you can get from it is that you can get a mean of the list or median of the list or the largest or smallest and just all kinds of information and it's very useful tool in stats so I recommend you guys uh, memorize how to use this tool okay so before we start we have to have a data in our list so first let's go to our list and type in a data so um, I'll be typing for this tutorial here I made up uh, a table called ages and I just uh, wrote down a bunch of ages here and I'll be using that but you guys can use whatever the data you have right now okay so here I have to type in all these first so 25 and 30 and uh, 25 36 40 28 42 33 okay so now that I typed in all my data on my list now I can uh, use one var stat okay how do I will use one var stat first we gotta quit out of the screen so we can hit second mode to quit out and once you quit out you'll be brought into this normal screen here right so next thing we have to do is we have to press button called stat and once hits once we hit stat you'll be brought into this screen here right where you can go into your list and check or where you can sort your data but we don't want to do that we want to go into this calc tab here right next to your edit how can we move to that tab we just simply hit up arrow or actually sorry just hit right arrow and once you do that um, you'll be brought into this screen here with a bunch of other stuff right but we want to use this first one called one var stats so hit that and hit okay so uh, those of you who have a newer calculator you'll see this screen right so all you have to do is you have to type in uh, the list number that you type your data into so for example in this case I typed in my age distribution on my L1 right so I have to type L1 well it's already there but I want to repeat this example so hit second and number one you will see uh, L1 on your screen but if you have data in like L3 you have to press second and number three well anyway so once you do that uh, you don't have to worry about this second column just hit down key and then leave it blank and then hit down one more and once the black box is covering that calculate area hit enter and once you do that you get this uh, whole data set so the first one is mean the second one is sum of your data the third one you will use that to find like um, standard deviations or a bunch of other stuff right so uh, oh, actually this fourth one is a sample standard deviation don't worry about the fifth one because it doesn't make sense that they're gonna give you a uh, population standard deviation so n representing how many items oh by the way you can uh, use your arrow key and then kind of move up and down and stuff so uh, okay but those of you who had an older calculator like TI-83 or older version of TI-84 you guys won't see that uh, screen uh, let me go back to that screen there so once I press one bar stat you guys won't see this screen right you guys will just see one bar stat with uh, parentheses or something like that all you have to do is just type in L1 right next to that parentheses and then hit enter then you will see exact same uh, result as what we do 
here. Okay, so that's how you look at a bunch of data is by using one bar stats in your calculator. So yeah, thank you guys for watching this tutorial. And if you guys have any other questions, please leave questions on the comment below. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks.